guys, welcome back to my channel. And today we're going to discuss how to find per the percent of a number. So here, on number one, fifty percent of seven hundred fifty. Here in fifty percent of seven hundred fifty, of means to multiply. So fifty percent needs to be multiplied by seven hundred fifty. To multiply that, you need to turn fifty percent into a decimal. Fifty percent to do to make this into a decimal. Erase the percent sign and move the decimal point two spaces to the left. One, two, equal to point fifty. Now, what we need to do is we need to multiply seven hundred fifty times point fifty or fifty percent. Would be zero. Since there is two decimal places, move the decimal point two spaces to the left. So the answer for number one would be three hundred and seventy-five. So that is fifty percent or one half of seven hundred fifty. Moving on to the next number, number two, thirty-three and one third percent of seven hundred fifty. Now, 33. 33 would be a whole number. So, our interpretation of 33 would be this. And one third, that would be converted to a decimal, which would be 3. Now, 33.3 .3 is still a percent. So, to remove the percent, we need to move the decimal point two spaces to the left. So, 1, 2. So this is what we need to multiply to 550. So 550 times point So since there are three decimal places, we move this three times to the left. So that so thirty three and one third percent of five hundred fifty would be one hundred eighty three point fifteen or one hundred fifty. Number three, one hundred twenty-five percent of thirty thirty-five hundred or three thousand five hundred. Again, to make this into a decimal, decimal to multiply, we need to remove the percent sign here. So we go with that. We remove we move the decimal point two places to the left. One. So one point twenty-five times. 3,500 so 3,500 times Here, since there are two decimal points, 
can move this to to the left. So as you can see, it increases because this is over 100. So the answer for number three is 4,375. Now the last one for number for number four, eighty-eight percent of nine thousand five hundred. So eighty-eight percent. To make it a decimal, we move the decimal point to space the left. It's now equal to eighty point eighty-eight. So now we multiply ninety-five thousand. 100 times 0.88 or 9,500 9, times 0.88 So there are two decimal places. Move this to the decimal place to the left. So the answer for number four would be eight thousand three hundred sixty. Yes.